Hey guys, what is going on? It's Janky, and in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make free thumbnails uh, for your guys' YouTube channel. So yeah, guys, um, basically, uh, I'm just going to be showing you guys the beginner's methods and stuff like that. If you guys want to go more in-depth, there's so many tutorials on how you guys can use Blender and stuff like that to make better uh, thumbnails and stuff like that. But I'm going to be going with the um, complete basics so that uh, you guys can get some thumbnails. So yeah, guys, uh, so basically... Uh, the first thing that you guys want to do is go to this website called pixlr.com slash e. It is a free, uh, like, Photoshop alternative uh, software and stuff like that. So, yeah. Then you guys are going to go into full HD and click create. Now, whenever you guys do this, you guys want to first off get your uh, background. So, the best way to do that is by searching up Fortnite map backdrop. You guys can add in any parts of the map that you guys want. Alright, so whenever you guys find a good picture that you guys want to use, I'm going to be using this one. What you guys want to do is you guys want to right click on it and then click copy image address right here. Whenever you guys do that, you guys can go back to Pixlr, go to layer, add URL as layer, paste it in, and there you guys go. Now, some of sometimes uh, it'll say there's an error that occurred or something. Uh, you guys have to find a new background because if that happens, there's really nothing you can do about it at that point. So yeah, uh, now that we have this done, uh, what I would recommend doing is getting the skin first. I'm going to be switching up Fortnite skin PNG. Make sure you guys are getting PNGs because those um, look the best. If you guys end up finding something that looks like really, really nice, um, and but it's not a PNG, I'll show you guys the other way on how you guys can get to the uh, specific skin that you guys want to use. Alright guys, so I'm just going to be using this skin. Uh, the reason is because, uh, as you guys know, like I said, some skins, uh, they will not actually be PNGs. And I just want, uh, if, if it is a PNG, then you guys can skip through this. But uh, I'm going to be showing you guys what to do if it is not. So yeah, what you guys want to do is right click again, copy image address, and then go to layer, add URL, and then paste it in. But yeah guys, so as you guys can see here, my image is not a PNG. So you guys, uh, if as you guys can see, it's not an actual PNG. So what you guys want to do is go up to the lasso select icon, and go right here, and then just go along the body like so, and then every once in a while, just go around it, and then it'll auto hook, and then just click backspace. So yeah, as you guys can see, you guys are um, over time deleting the white background and it'll look really clean at the end uh, so yeah guys Alright guys, so whenever you guys finish outlining this whole entire uh, character, what you guys want to do is to lasso everything, and you guys want to get rid of all this extra white. So to do that, what you guys want to do is get the lasso and just go through all these lines, be very steady. Alright, and then you guys are going to be going around just like this. And then link these two sides, and then backspace. And there you go. Now the character is completely uh, out of it, and now what you guys are going to do is take it, the character, and then make it as big as you guys want. You guys can center it up, do whatever you guys want with it. And then I'm also going to be getting rid of this little thing down there, just like that. There you go. And if you guys are done with that, uh, you guys can select on the image and then turn up the, uh, go up to here, hue and saturation, you guys can turn up the saturation. 
uh, just to make it look a little bit uh, cleaner and better. And then also go to filter, outline, or outer glow. Actually, I'm going to do outer glow. And you guys can just turn this up. And there we go. Now it has an outer glow. And then if you guys go to the background, and then go to adjustment, hue and saturation, turn it all the way up. And the colors will pop out a lot more. And then what you guys can do for the last step is uh, add in your guys' text. So uh, if you guys want to download free fonts for your guys' like, text and stuff, I'll leave a link in the video description on how to do that. But I'm just going to be putting in, uh, for instance, if you guys are just going to put in um, Fortnite Montage Number 1. Let's just say you're going to do that. I'm going to make the color of the text white. And I'm going to be making it probably an orangish color because that goes well with the everything else. Then I'm going to increase the size of it. So like so. And I'm going to rasterize it. So to rasterize it, make sure you guys are selected on this right now. Layer. Rasterize text slash element. And click this rear inch tool right here. And then you guys can tilt it. Do whatever you guys want. And guys, for this background, I'm also going to be adding in a little outer glow to it as well. Just to make it pop a little bit more. As you guys can see, it makes it look very nice if you guys add that extra outer glow. And uh, yeah, guys, that is basically how you guys make a free um, YouTube thumbnail for your guys' like, videos. Now, guys, this could work for any game that you guys want to play. This could work even for IRL videos. You guys can add the outline to yourself. You guys can crop yourself out and add the outline. You guys can do this for like anything so yeah um i just wanted to make a video on this because i've seen comments of people wanting me to do this and also people in my stream chat say it as well uh so yeah guys anyway um please guys like and subscribe i appreciate that so much thank you guys so much for watching this video and um yeah guys i'll talk to you all in the next one